Hi, I'm Bob Kutchbaugh, the owner and broker of Carlton Realty. And I'm coming to you today to talk a little bit about the current market. We're in the summer of 2019. Uh, there have been some things that have changed and some other things that haven't changed. I guess the good news for buyers is that there's a few more homes available today than there were a year ago. So the inventory is up, but just slightly. Affordability is still there in that interest rates are very, very reasonable compared to history. And many people still are finding that they can buy a house for the same amount, if not much more than their rent. I do want to talk to you for a minute about rents. There is a situation going on where rents are going up significantly. And of course, one of the solutions to that is to buy a house. So a lot of people today are buying houses because they've experienced significant rental increases. And we're talking about rental increases far above the rate of inflation. So if you want to be able to predict what your housing costs are, you might want to consider buying a house. Now it is a very competitive market. It is not uncommon for there to be seven to 10 offers in the first weekend or so of a house coming on the market. So you need to respond quickly when a house comes on the market that you like. And you'll need an agent who can respond quickly to help show you that property. Buyers who want to think about it for a while are losing. Um, because most of the time the property will be in contract soon after it goes on the market. So a buyer who takes a day or two to think about it just doesn't even have a chance. So you have to be prepared. You should be pre-qualified. That will help you a lot. Um, many buyers are offering more than list price. So don't be surprised when your real estate professional recommends that you pay more than list price. One of the things you can do to make your offer more attractive is to ask for the home inspection, but state that you don't plan on asking for any repairs or remedies. Uh, if you're unhappy with the home inspection, you can still void the contract, so that's still an option. Uh, other people offer that if it doesn't appraise quite high enough that they'll pay the difference or they'll offer a large earnest money deposit to show the seller that they're serious. But what's most important in being successful is that you make an offer according to what the seller desires. One of the mistakes buyers make is demanding immediate possession of a house when the sellers live there a long time and needs a little time to move out. So if that's really the big sticking point, it's probably advisable to give that seller uh, some time to move out if that's what's going to make your offer more desirable than the competing offers. So, seek the advice of an experienced real estate agent. They can go over all these options with you as to how to be successful in today's market. But ultimately, you decide. You decide if you want to offer more than the list price, which is common, or offer with a home inspection, but not ask for remedies unless it's really serious, uh, or offer an escalation cost that you'll pay $1,000 more than the next highest offer, not to exceed uh, your budget, not to exceed what you're approved for. Um, but in today's market, you need to be competitive. So if you have questions, call us here at Carlton Realty at 614-891-0000 or visit us online at carltonrealty.com. Click subscribe so that you'll be notified when new videos come out. Thank you for watching.